Typically, we have to say trumpets or you're too loud. And I felt like you guys could play out a little bit more. Give me a little bit more. Maybe it's the stage, you know, maybe it's this. But we're going to work on some of these things with how we hear each other and where our balance are is. And we're going to be in the Bluenote special, all right? I didn't have a score, so it's going to take me a second here to find where I want to work. But I definitely work. We're going to work on some of the trombone solo stuff. And um, work on a few things rhythm-wise, what we're doing when we're accompanying uh, soloists, and how we're going to vary what we do so that it gives them a different palette to work off of. And then most of the soloists that I heard, I felt like, so let's talk about how, how can we solo? What things can we change? We can change pitch, yeah. We can change rhythm, yeah. What else? What else? Volume. Yes. No choice. Style, you no choice of pitch, right? What articulation? What about timbre of tone? You know, and I think that that's, I'm going to ask you two trombone players when we get into it here to try to do something other than we all do kind of like warm round tone, really good. Like this is big band, man. Spread spread it a little bit. Give it a little character. Do something in your solo to make it have a little bit more than just a difference in pitch and a dif difference in rhythm. I felt like you did a little bit of that towards the end of your tenor solo. And you don't, you don't understand what I'm saying? And then trumpets, I think we need to fill it up a little more at times. There's a few times in here that I gotta find, and you might be able to help me, where we kind of have a line that it gets past, it's like saxes and bones and then trumpets. And I felt like that the, when we're talking about passing energy and keeping that energy moving, that when we got to the trumpets, I wanted to hear more, I wanna hear more, and I wanna hear this is a big band, you know? It's like we all do round really well. Let's let's spread a little bit. Does that make sense? Yeah? Okay. Let, let's try that right at the top. So what we want to do here is we're listening to each other, right? Big band, jazz, rock and roll, concert band, orchestra, whatever you're doing, you got to play with really big ears and open up and listen to, uh, already? Yeah, I'm in it. <laughs> um, listen to what each other's doing, and you got to match, know who's giving you energy and who you're giving it to. So at the top here, we have saxes with a sort of backing line, trombones. The saxes have the melody. Then that melody gets passed kind of to the trumpets, yes, and offset to the trombones. Let's make sure that when we are have our section, that we're matching energy. Also, that we're making shape with lines, that they don't just go some mono volume, mono volume, mono volume. Let's try it right at the beginning. Yeah? One, two, one, two. You got it. Give me more right there. We got a match with the sax that you're giving us. Can you give me more on that? Maybe get our bells up a little bit. Sit up. Get your back off the back of the seat. We don't. I, I guarantee you, it's a physiological thing when you sit with your back. On the back of the seat, it collapses your air cage. It doesn't allow your diaphragm, your physiology, to fill up your horn with as much air as you can if you sit up straight. So give me more on that trombones. Trumpets, too. But uh on those hits, I want to hear, uh, it's trombones still at the beginning there. Da-da-uh. Yeah? 
So, and then when the trumpets come in, when you have your little line, fill it up, fill it up. More, more, more. Here we go. A one, bright. a two, a one, a two. It's a little bright. A one, a two, a one, a two. go to straight fours instead of the swing B, or I'm going to move it to a different symbol, I'm going to move it on a different side of the symbol, give a different palette. Like when I play the kid, I'm a percussionist, it's like this is my saxophone symbol, this is my trumpet symbol, I'm going to do this for this, you know, try to change it up a little bit. And for the first two you play, listen, 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 what they call it down here is in the cracks, playing in the cracks with that street beat stuff, it's not swung, it's not straight, it's in the cracks. Also look up the big four, what that's all about in the beat and how that feels. Thank you so much. I hope our comments were helpful to you. Keep playing. Enjoy what you're doing. Music's a great thing. Enjoy it, all right? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.